Did she really think she was gonna get away with this? This video is brought to you by Beating Black and Blue. Beating Black and Blue, my brand new book, Being a Black Police Officer in America Under Siege. Get the link in the description section. Like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell so you get notifications. Anytime I go live, I make a video. Y'all know what to do. Let's get into this. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen, and ladies. I had to make a video about this. I just had to. This was the cr most cringiest, weirdest, dumbest, Karenist video I have ever seen in my life. I can't believe this girl thought she was going to get away with this. Thank God for the surveillance camera at the corner store. Because this little dumb, brain-dead, social justice warrior was going to try to be, I don't know what she was going to do. She was going to lie and say that a dude in a Lamborghini wrecked her car. I don't know what he backed into her at the light. I mean, I don't know what she was thinking. But thank God for the cameras. Y'all need to watch this. This girl is nuts. This is the generation of young people that we raise that are completely nuts. Roll the film. Oh, shit. Wow. <laughs> What's funny? Uh, that's my new fucking car. Usually when you rear end people, that's not how this works. Uh, it's okay. I'm going to call the cops real quick. But yeah, you're saying that I hit you from behind. No, you hit me in the front of it. Remember when I was at a red light? Remember? You remember? You want somebody to say remember? No, you already know they lying. You hit my car. Oh, yeah? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's cool. Uh, probably move the car from thing and I'll call the cops for you. Here's where it gets. Here's where it gets dumb. Now, now, you, now you see her walk up to him, knock and say, "Remember when you hit my car that time?" Uh, so let's not look at that one. Here is the part that just blew my socks off. Is that this girl tries to evoke racism? Now you just saw what she looked like. She's white. She is white. She is white. Don't let nobody try to trick. Them. Just because you in the hood, just because you like black dudes, don't mean that you somehow ain't white. Listen to what she said to another white person. And that's why you white people, that's why you white people get all this fucking privilege with this nice ass car. How do you know? Bitch, so, so that's my new fucking car. When you listen to too much Cardi B and... <laughs> I don't know why white, some white girls do this. They want to be black so bad. They just they just convert to a to a ghetto. They, they're not even a normal black person. They want to be a ghetto, trashy black person. She did all that. You white people, that's why y'all white people got privilege. Cause you cause you drive a nice course like this. Well, maybe if you wasn't an idiot and you were dis, wasn't disingenuous, maybe when if you do something to gain value or to 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 create value. Instead of probably being a leech, your mama probably bought you that car. You probably ain't worth a dime. All you do is want to date Tyrone them and think you black. That's probably why you ain't going to never be nobody. But anyway, I leave that for, for God to decide. But watch the film on how she completely lied and made it about race and she was, she was completely in the wrong. Watch this. Do you have where it went in or where she drove into it? Or? You look, you were here and she can't look. Boom. You see? Brand new. I don't know if it's brand new. A Lamborghini Aventador. That's like a $300,000, $400,000 car. And little, little Shanae, and I don't think her insurance, the way her insurance set up, she ain't gonna be able to, she ain't gonna be able to afford to pay, fix that. So, but anyway, the gentleman, um, I don't know his name, but I think he's friends with a gentleman I know. I, I couldn't find his page, but um, I think he's a social media influencer guy. So anyway, I, I'll figure out who he is and probably link to his page. I think his, he posted the video originally. I couldn't find his page, so I found it here. But anyway, what do y'all think about that? Is that crazy? Is that the crazy? Is that, that one of the craziest things you've ever heard? Why are our young people so brain dead? It's cool to be all ghetto, and then and then being ghetto, you think you you think it's cool to invoke racial slurs, and then you think it's cool to lie. Somebody, God help these kids. Help these kids before it's too late. Like and subscribe to the channel. Comment in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this video. Um, get my book, Beating Black and Blue, Being a Black Police Officer in America Under Siege. You can get it on Amazon, none signed. You can get it from our store, signed copy. Uh, make sure you get the signed copy if you want to get it now because once it's out, uh, I'm going to take a, a lull on, on signing copies because i got to make sure that I've caught up with everybody. So you're going you to have to wait a long time. I, maybe, maybe.
maybe I won't sign anymore. I don't know what I'm going to do about it. Um, because believe it or not, it takes a lot of work to sign thousands of copies of books. I, I didn't think it was. I took it lightly. It's incredibly, it's an incredible blessing. But man, I got dizzy and my, I mean, it was, it was, it was, it was tough. So uh, if you want to sign a copy, get it now. I love you guys. Appreciate you. Let me know in the comment section what you think. See you on the next one. I'm out. Thank you.